Hi guys, welcome to Revolutionary Motion. I'm Kata. And I'm Clemens. And today we have a very interesting video for you guys. We're going to measure how hard we can serve with a modern racket compared to a wood racket. And hopefully we'll see that there's quite a substantial difference. So we notice that the newer versions and the newer models of the tennis rackets are far superior to the wood rackets. So first we're just going to warm up our regular racket and we'll measure that first and then we'll go over to the wood racket after that. So enjoy the warm up guys. Okay, I'm ready. All right, so we're starting with kata serve with a regular modern racket. So let's see how fast you can go. <laughs> 145. Not bad, not bad. Come on, next one. Try to hit even harder. Flex your arm, blast it. 143, all right. Come on, you got to get a little bit more into the serve. You got this. One thirty-six, but you miss hit that one. One, one more, one last uh, one. It was too far for me. One thirty-one. Let's do one last one. We can't stop on that one. One thirty-four. All right. Here we go, just to show you guys. This is all in kilometers per hour. So we have 134, 131, 136, 143, and 145. Okay, so now this one? Yep. Oh my God, it's so big. Give me a sec. All right, so now we're gonna do the wood racket for Kata. Let's see how that compares. 136, 140, don't smile. <laughs> I think I'm from another age. Come on. 130, that was a slow one. Yeah. And you got to snap that wrist on top of the ball. Okay. One last one. 141. All right, so just so you guys see, at the 141, 130, 140, 136. I'll yeah, try to so keep it low. So now we're gonna measure Clem and see how he does with the modern racket. <laughs> 196. All right, I can go harder than that, that's for sure. 204. Okay, that's not bad. One more, come on. 203. Mm. One more, See if come I on. can top it. 202. Ah, Maybe I'm can't beat it today. Go right. to the camera, no? Okay, how do you show the... Here we go, I'll do it. Two, 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 three, two, four, and one ninety six. And now let's see if anything changes with the wooden racket. Turn it on. It's on. I'm let's ready. Take a look. Oh my god. One seventy five. That's <laughs> a difference. Big difference. I didn't hit it. One ninety eight. <sighs> Tough to control. 186. 159. It's impossible. The racket is way too heavy. So, here it is. 159. 186. 198. 175. That's it. That's it. As we just saw, it widely changes from her to me. 
In her case, she has a lot of control with a wooden racket, almost more control than with her regular modern racket. And her serving speed wasn't far off, maybe like three to five miles an hour, right? That's it. In my case, my serving speed was also not that far off, but I have absolutely zero control over the racket because it's just too heavy for me. Because the wood rackets for you know, everybody that doesn't know out there is a lot heavier than the modern rackets. That's why I couldn't get my ball, the racket on top of the ball and I couldn't smash it down into, into the court. Now, why did she have such an easy time to control the shots while I didn't? It's very simple. In general, her arm moves a little bit slower, and so with extra weight, it moves even slower, but she feels a lot of control because the racket doesn't move that fast. But because it's so heavy, it still gives her a good amount of power. In my case, I have a very fast arm, so I would need a lot more strength to control this heavy racket when I swing it just as fast as my modern racket. I hope you guys like this little experiment. Please click the subscribe button if you liked the video, and we'll see you guys soon.